Hey everyone, I'm Sam Tan. We're here at the uh, Smashbox Studios for the Hunger Games shoot. I play a uh, District 8 boy. Everyone's getting sent away. They're leaving everything behind. They're gonna go fight to the death. I do stuns. Definitely some interesting moments. Some people got hurt, you know, people swinging bats. Uh, someone got hit in the nose. It looked good and everyone stayed in character, but you know, definitely some unfortunate moments in there. I took a, took a fall from like an eight foot platform, but so you just gotta get back up and you know, it's all for the good of making great films. The whole cast is really cool. I didn't expect, you know, everyone to be cool, but everyone was super nice and everyone got along really well. When I was in 11th grade, I went to prom, but 12th grade, I asked two girls, and they both said yes, but I didn't end up going. I asked one, she said yes, we were going out at the time, I broke up with her, and then I needed a prom date, so I asked another girl, Amanda, and she said yes also, and we were going to go together, but I didn't end up going, because I really didn't want to go to prom, honestly. I took Amanda to Starbucks, and we both got our favorite drinks, and I had the girl write, will you go to prom with me? She, she just went on with the conversation, like we're talking right now, and. Out of nowhere, she just kind of freaked out, and I, I you know, knew right, right then that she saw it, and she said, yeah, right away. My dream celeb prom day would be Mila Kunis or Natalie Portman. I think Natalie Portman is an amazing actress, super gorgeous, really down to earth, and I would show up looking like a G <laughs> with Natalie Portman. Best way to party after a prom. I actually DJed my 12th grade prom. I showed up to the after party and like got, you know, but the best way to, to do the prom after party is to DJ your own prom after party, for sure. Thanks for joining us, and check out The Hunger Games when it comes out.